before we hit the test track, we thought it would be a good idea for our testers to burn off some nervous energy, taking on another of Love Day's great experiences, gel blasting. Now the competition is about to get serious. And last week, our teams battled it out on the jet skis. This week, they are literally battling it out in the trenches. After a few practice shots, it was time to get dirty. We've been broken up into teams. Maka, Jamie and I versus Sam, Ian and a few crew members we roped into the action. Go, Jamie, go! Maka! G'day, mate. How are you? There's a little something I want to talk to you about. What do you want to talk about, mate? Our score. Yeah, we haven't finished the scores yet, mate. But how are we going? Mate, I'm sure that we can work this out some better way, can't we? Does it have to come to this? What do you drink? What if I buy you something? We'll talk about the scores later, mate. Just, you'll be all right. You're looking really good at the moment, all right? Thanks, Maka. No worries. <laughs> Macca and Angie did after points from me earlier, so I think I'm going to get them back. Now, Sam. Wow. Dance, Macca, dance. <laughs> I've got to say, running around in the trenches with a gel blaster wasn't something I thought I was really going to enjoy. <laughs> However, once the adrenaline takes over and the confidence grows, it can make you feel like settling a few scores. For all the times Mac has made me sit through his bad jokes, He's a dead man. This has seriously become a free-for-all. I don't know who's shooting who. Each of our representatives have been scored on how well they avoided getting shot. And here are the results. Well done, Sam. You must have been very sneaky, only being hit 10 times. In second place is Jamie, who somehow managed to avoid more than a few ambushes with only 18 hits. Ian from Canterbury Caravans comes in third with 25 hits, but he cops a 50 hit penalty from trying to bribe the judges. Crew member Kono, Maka and myself all come in with over 50 hits each. It feels like we were getting targeted for some reason. Hmm. Well, that was fun and no one had to get hurt. That was pretty full on. So much fun. Oh my gosh, I want to keep doing it all day. 